The shoulder problems that we see are mainly rotator cuff problems. Uh, rotator, the rotator cuff is a series of muscle attachments on the shoulder which uh, are very important in allowing us to have the full motion of our shoulder, the forward flexion and the internal rotation, external rotation, and give our shoulder the ability to move in really 180 degrees of motion, uh, which is unique for a joint. So it's a very unique joint that relies on its tendons and ligaments to control the motion and give it strength. The problem is these ligaments and tendons can be injured and irritated with uh, injury and or with degenerative processes of aging. Uh, and these shoulder problems can be very limiting because they, we use our shoulders so continuously through the day. And they can create a lot of pain. People who are athletes, tennis players, ball players, uh, are, have, and golfers uh, have, you know, an intimate relationship with their shoulder. And when it doesn't feel good, their game isn't good and they're not happy. So where we're excited is that we now can, by using interventional uh, techniques of uh, regenerative process, in other words, using platelets and stem cells, we can actually heal these areas of tendonitis. We can heal the uh, tears in tissue. Uh, we don't yet have the capability of healing a complete tear, but we can heal most of the other tears that occur in the rotator cuff with uh, biological agents.